Hi, I'm Ed Hawkins, Professor of Climate Science at the University of Reading. If you're interested in climate change, you may have seen these colourful stripes on your social media feed, in newspapers or at climate policy events such as the COP. Sometimes climate science is complicated and it involves a lot of data. Data is important in science, but sometimes it can be confusing and sometimes it can be misinterpreted. That's why I created the warming stripes. They show in one single image the incontrovertible fact that our world is heating up. Each stripe represents a year and together they show annual average temperatures through time. The blue years are the coldest years, the reds are the hottest. Overall, the picture is clear. Our cities, our nations and our whole planet is getting hotter. Although they carry a serious message, they're also simple, colourful and make an instant impact. And I've been delighted to see how many people have used these stripes all across the world. They've been used everywhere, from tiny pin badges worn by US senators on their smart suits, to hundreds of feet wide on the main stage at Reading Festival. This image right here on our screen is one of the most defining, one of the most crucial images of our times. I love seeing where they'll pop up next. Graphics like this transcend people's languages and background. They show that no matter where you live, climate change affects everyone in every corner of the earth. 2021 is a massive year for action on climate change. Recently we marked the return of the United States to the Paris Agreement with a special Climate Stars and Stripes graphic, which adapted the national flag of America to show rising temperatures. This year the UN's Intergovernmental Panel on Climate Change will report the latest scientific evidence. Then in Glasgow at COP26, the world's big chance to do something about it. All eyes will be on Glasgow, not just the eyes of the world now, but the judgment of future generations. To make meaningful changes, we need more people to talk about climate and understand it. We think we've found a way of achieving this. Go to showyourstripes.info and download the stripes for your countries, your states and your cities. Then please show your stripes and start some conversations about the climate.